Hello, everyone. <laughs> she didn't say it over to you. She gave us no warning. She gave us no warning. I was messing with Becca as we spoke. I think some of you think I only do it on camera, and that is not the case. I mess with Becca every chance I get. Hello, and welcome to the Oak and Lamb YouTube channel. We are Rachel Webb, Becca Oaks, Anna Lamb, owners and craft educators here at Oak and Lamb. Today... We are talking about Amazon's massive spring sale. I love a good Amazon sale. Who's already been on? Well, and <laughs> these chairs that we have are like boingy and fun. Anyway, who has already been on? What have you purchased? The spring sale, spring sale is similar to prom day, right? But they yes. have some pretty decent deals up to like 40. It says 40% off, but I saw one that was 49% Becca, off. There's one thing we didn't look up to see if it was on sale. Resin. A yard goose. What? We could potentially have a yard goose on sale. Which, by what the way. What is a yard goose? That was negligent of me. Which, by the way, is, I think it's going to be my goal this spring is to um, obtain a yard goose. Anna, it's a plaster or concrete legitimate goose <laughs> he's that, on, you, that you dress for the season. He's 23 inches high. Um, he is not on sale. He's a full fledged thirty nine ninety nine. But look at, <laughs> at this bunny costume. I, I can't. I just. I have to have a yard goose. It's so cute. Oh, look, um, Rachel. There's a bee. Are you? Is your? Are y'all's computers supposed to be connected? No, this is for me and Rachel, not for you. Okay. Oh, yeah. sorry. Um, but any anywho, we have. Oh God, I want to say like close to fifty links for you. At least that's how it felt when I was linking them all. <laughs> Um, Most of the, actually, I have zero craft related links. My, I, don't I don't think I either. do either. But yeah. Welcome to a lifestyle video. Sorry. Yeah, we're actually, let's talk about that for a second. Okay. Rachel had this amazing idea. Um, it wasn't an amazing idea as much as it was, let's fill a void that we see and that we would like to pour in to our channel in ways that we're passionate about. Other than crafting, as well as crafting. Yes. So it's not like we're going to be like, that's it, guys. We're not crafting no anymore. No more crafting. It's going to be supplemental to crafting. So it's going to be in the form of short, uh, organic, pre-recorded content, and uh, some lives that we're going to do. Um, you might see a bonus live here and there. Uh, if Meaning so, an additional one in the week. Yeah, if so, that's phenomenal. Enjoy them. Uh, they're not going to be every week. There's no specific schedule out, especially when we gear up for summer. People are going to be taking summer vacation. People are going to be, uh, we're going to do them later in the day, earlier in the day, different days. So bear with us through the summer season as we have littles and we have vacations. But we thought about doing some more lifestyle entertainment-based content it's going to make you laugh, help you out in other areas of your life, like organizing your house and organizing your car, some life hacks that don't have to do with crafting, as well as all of our normal content that we're going to have. Uh, so today we decided, Becca said, we don't have to make these links craft related. Let's make them uh, whatever we want, whatever that we see that's on sale that we want to purchase or that we have purchased them that we love. So we'll be able to share those with you. So we're, we have some really fun content coming up. Like we, we have some really fun ones. Some that you're just going to sit and laugh the whole time you're watching. Some that are going to be, you know, uh, really telling about our lives and our stories <laughs> and things. So uh, gear up for those. They're going to be great. They're coming your way. Some travel related ones, which if you haven't seen it, I know I, I was looking back at comments. Some of you all have already seen it and are talking about it. Rachel did a vlog of her honeymoon, which was really fun. Um, I need to watch the whole thing. I haven't gotten to watch it yet. And we we live in East Tennessee, like 45 minutes from the Pigeon Forge area. And we get questions all the time about what should I do when I'm in Pigeon Forge? Where should I eat? And it's so funny because I never think that people come to our area yeah. to vacation. Yeah. And it's one of the, the most traveled to vacation spots, and especially in the Eastern yeah. US. I would, yeah. So yeah. we're going to do a couple of videos on that like I think we're gonna go to Dollywood one day and talk all about Dollywood we're gonna do um, a severe one where we talk about our favorite restaurants or just things to do there like hidden gyms and yeah. things like that yeah. so that just some additional content things like be that really fun. Yeah, yeah you'll get to know us better get to know the area we live um, 
Gosh, we got some fun stuff in the works. Again, ju just to continue to have fun and continue to um, grow here on YouTube and things like that, which uh, it, it is the spring sale today on Amazon, but it is also still National Craft Month. So if you guys want to grab your membership at Oak and Lamb, we talk about it all the time. If you guys want more information about it, please ask. We've got cut files. We've got free courses if you happen to have a Cricut. Uh, we have a private Facebook group that's only for our flock members. We have so many amazing perks in that membership, and it is a phenomenal price today, 40 bucks off of your first year with us using the code CRAFTY, C-R-A-F-T-Y. So don't hesitate. The sale's almost over. It's still National Craft Month, so slide in, grab that sale. Um, ask any questions you have, but Anna's got a bunch of links that we're going to talk about. I've got a bunch of links. Becca's got a bunch of links. I plugged my laptop in first because... Uh, she don't hold a charge. So I want to get mine over with just in case my laptop dies. Um, but anyways, let, let me know if you have any questions. You guys seem to be doing great. I'm still going to make it to Dollywood one of these days. Dollywood, you have to go at least once in your life. It's just one of those things. It's I Dollywood. I think Kat, Beck and I had talked about getting uh, season passes this year. So maybe we should make that happen if y'all come camping again this year. Yeah. Yeah, I remember growing up, we would get, now we weren't well off growing up or anything like that, but we we would always make it to where we got season passes to Dollywood. And we would do it with our homeschool family friends, shocker. And we would literally go two or three times a week, we would go to Dollywood. And I have the best memories um, at Dollywood, just phenomenal memories. What's the one thing Every doll, and we'll we'll recap this too in our videos. Okay. But what's the one thing every Dollywood goer has to experience? Cinnamon bread. <sighs> Did she steal yours? Yeah. No, no, no. That was it. I was wanting you to. There's say only it. one oh, answer. There's I, only oh, one gosh. answer. <laughs> I thought it was. I thought it was like a you were gonna say yours and I'm gonna say mine. No. Um, I think there's still a lot to to get to experience because uh, we always would like pack little sandwiches and stuff to eat. So I haven't gotten to like eat my way through Dollywood well, yet. And I really want to do that. I will say though, Rach, some of the food, you know, when you first go in, it has the sausages and the uh -huh, onions that smell uh -huh. so good. It doesn't taste like that. It's very it disappointing, but it's good. very disappointing. So there are some things that you can skip and we'll talk about mm. all of those things. I'm so excited though. So yeah. we're going to do some fun stuff like that. Now, again, we need to know if you like the vlog style content, the type of lifestyle content that we have. Um, but we're excited to throw out some extra content for you guys to see how you enjoy that as well. Um, we're already halfway to 41,000 subscribers, and we I feel like we just hit 40. So we're, we're super thankful for you guys and all that. So if you haven't already subscribed, completely free to do that for us. Um, okay, who wants to talk about Amazon? You do. Me well, listen, oh, when we started this, we had like 60-something viewers, and now we're down to 30. So apparently a bunch of people aren't wanting to. <laughs> They'll come back. They'll come back. Okay, I think that I have so many links. Um, now, there's a lot of stuff for toddlers. There's a lot of stuff for us. There, I mean, there's there's so much. I had another list of things I was going to look up, but I physically can't because I have too many links. Uh, and are we on now? Yeah. We're facing oh. you and going over to your computer. Lapa Tapa. Thank you. So, um... Simple Joy by Carter's is one of my favorite jammy jam uh, brands for Charlie. So the ones that I get him are the Snug Fit right here. The Simple Joy, the footy ones with the Snug Fit. I think they're super true to size. But look at this. All of this is on the spring deal. So instead of linking you guys a specific um, onesie, I just link this page for you guys. But I absolutely love them. These are my favorite. I love uh, these right here, these little tank tops, so freaking cute. Three of them for less than 12 bucks. You cannot beat that. So all these are on the spring. So look at this. Look at this little swimsuits and swim trunks. Stop. 12 bucks. I'm going to, I think I'm going to buy a couple of these. Little bitty denim shorts. So cute. Okay. Uh, now prices, again, they vary depending on what you want. Okay. Next is this. I got to take my link off. Next is this, um, what's the matter, Becca? Nothing, I'm just helping her. Oh, okay, sorry. Um, next is this thing. So you plug it oh, into yeah, your normal it. outlet at home, and then it gives you like four outlets, USB-C, USB. 
Um, I have these all over the house in Knoxville and I absolutely love them. Now, what I like about these is that it's also a surge protector. So it's not, and it's safe. You know, there's a ton of great reviews on something like this. Don't get one that doesn't have good reviews, but this is, it was 20 bucks and that's what I paid for mine at home. And it's on sale for $9 for the spring deal. You need to get these. They're super good to have around. You can take them with you on vacation um, if you want to and kind of pop it in the socket there. You can also screw it in if you want to, which I think is super nice. So I love these. We have like four of them at the house. Next, I had to include my O Cedar Mop, guys. I want one of these. I'll, okay, I love my O Cedar Mop. Now, I will say I do not have the rinse clean. The rinse clean separates the dirty water from the clean water. Yeah, I want that mm -hmm. too. So when you is this wring one the it out, clean? yes. So okay. when you wring it out, it holds the dirty water in its own reservoir. It has uh, the the normal mopping bucket too. I think it's a little bit harder to clean, like rinse out and clean. But honestly, that's fine. But I absolutely love my. Is that a foot mop. pedal that like rinse? Yeah, oh, it's, okay. you just stick the you stick the mop in in the the right little you know, nook and cranny there, and then you just press the pedal and it spins all the water out of it. It's super nice. Um, mm -hmm. uh, I need that. I love my OC. Can you mop. just put it in the cart? Sure, Becca. Thank you. There's so many things that I need <laughs> in or the Or add cart it to too. my list or something. I'll add it to my list. Okay. I'm going to make an order after we finish, after we're finished. I said this. once we're making it really big, when we do one of these videos. Once we're making it really big. <laughs> at the end of the video, we're just going to hit. Not even really big but bigger it's than what we're semi hitting big it. yeah <laughs> i mean because i think our entire cart right now is like a thousand dollars and one time we're just going to order everything that we've put in the cart <laughs> Dig it out because everything we put in the cart we want we, or yeah. we have or we have yeah absolutely yeah. everything and when you all get to my list you're gonna die but i want everything i can't wait for anna to explain to you some things that are on her <laughs> list because i'm as i'm adding the links i'm like this is ridiculous <laughs> But okay. if you don't have an O Cedar mop, pay the money for it. The heads pop off so easy. And you throw them in the washing machine. Can you get the heads at Walmart or something, you or do you have to order? Yes. Okay. Now, Miss Lisa is saying I use a Dollar Tree bucket that fits in there with the regular mop. Oh, as the second. Uh, oh, as the, the oh. rinse bucket. Oh, neat! Just underneath it. Oh, that's smart. That's smart. Um, but I love my O Cedar mop. Absolutely love it. Well, Pearson's telling y'all what okay. he thinks about it. Next, I think me and Becca have a duplicate. I think no, I didn't put this. I didn't put it in there. Okay, mm -hmm. so me and Becca both uh -huh. own this. I th Does Anna have a nugget ice maker? I don't have counter space for it. Well, no, I gave you the one that was from the studio. Uh, it's you? downstairs, but I don't have counter space for it. And why did you want it, Tom? I was gonna put it in the camper for the summer. Oh, that makes sense. Um, this is like stranded on a desert island. Must have for me. Like, I, I have to have my nugget ice maker, okay? I love it. I turn it on every morning, and I'm just so giddy watching the little pellets of ice fall because I have to have it, okay? Word of word of wisdom here. I would plug it into a coconut, okay? That's, I, would I would draw my power from something just to have my nugget ice. I also, I've had one for five years and I also swear by it, love mine. I am gonna tell you, make sure every so often you put it in cleaning mode and run vinegar through it. Yeah. We have been negligent about that and it's taken us, a, it, honestly, it's taken us almost two days in continual to cleaning clean mode it. to get it descaled. It's finally there. But it like, well, the yeah. other thing is, is you can use like mineral water or already filtered water, like bottled water uh -huh. in it yeah. instead of the soft, like, what do you use? Well, you have the whole system. We you have the whole the, water we, system. We use pure So that's water. helpful. Distilled, whatever. You shouldn't have any descaling, but. We still do, like still. Make sure you're cleaning these things regularly. Yeah. Mark it on your calendar once a month or something like that. But I have to have my pellet Love ice. that pellet Love ice maker. Oh, Love it. So good. If you have the counter space, Get it, do it. Um, it is pricey, yes, but if you like pellet ice, I promise it's gonna pay for itself. You're gonna love it. Um, when I would get super desperate, I would purchase bags of ice from Sonic. And by the way, it's good. It's like exactly like Sonic. It's good, yeah. crunchy, Yeah. it's phenomenal. My ice. kids sneak in there all the time and put their grubby hands in there and grab it. Yeah. Guys, yeah. here's my that, granny face. <laughs> that is also what we call it. You totally just burped. Guys, this is my granny. Hey, I looked the other way, which happened to be towards my mind. Sweet God. 
It's macaroni panties. <laughs> They're on sale. <laughs> I'm just going to go ahead and add them to the car. I kind of want to try them, though. What's not, like, are they true Listen, to size? They're true to size. They're 100% cotton. Look how cute some of these are. I normally don't wear, like, Oh, I'm my like, God. Those have more coverage than my bathing suits. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, I, these are the only panties that I wear. Um, Sweet Jesus. They so come short. up so high. They're almost down to your knees. They come up so high. You may as well wear boxer briefs. <laughs> they come up so high. Did these leave so much to the imagination, okay? <laughs> I told her we needed to, like, you. cut holes in them and bedazzle them. And Let me like, take them yeah. a little risque. Yeah. <laughs> I only get the black. Rachel, oh. those are lovely. <laughs> those are lovely. Um, I absolutely love them. Hey, I That got, is cheap, though. My husband married me. Knowing that. Knowing that these are the only underwear I own. <laughs> and he doesn't care. That's only like two, what two fifty, two seventy five a pair. When I tell you I'm making an order, four I'm, for fifteen. I'm telling you, it's a good oh, price. Oh, it's fourteen thirty nine. Now yeah. look how many yeah. sizes, guys. It goes up to a five X, extra small five X. See, I don't, I don't like my underwear to be tight, so I don't really know what size to get. Go here. for the five X, Becca. Oh my. <laughs> Beck, if I was you, I'd get the XL. Off it. Could we yeah, please uh, order so a pair of five X just to see how many of us can fit in them? Well, no, because I almost be could have worn person. them before. It will probably be one person, me. But anyways, these are the granny panties that I uh, absolutely adore. So when I saw they were on sale, I had absolutely no hesitation to add these to the... Like, I didn't even think about it. I was so excited. Um, I, this was like a... I don't really know, but I like it. I love a zero-gravity chair. And then I saw all these little cup holders and stuff. and I, I mean, that's a pretty good price, in my opinion. It had really good reviews. 70 bucks. I thought that was a decent deal. Original 110. So look at all these colors too. So this is what I'm gonna say about those. I love those for home. They are not practical to travel with. What do you mean? Like they don't fold up good to put in a camper or the back of your vehicle. I think you have camping on the brain. I just mean like on the We are going camping camping in two weeks. Camping's life. back porch though by the even by the pool that'd be nice i'm a little bit dying right here it says to each his own but a pass for me haynes and victoria's secret for me that is two opposite <laughs> ends of the spectrum there man i used to haynes do haynes. And victoria's i secret. used to do haynes but i have i have to do a hundred percent cotton i'm a hundred percent cotton gal that's just who my I favorite underwear in the entire world is Lululemon Hipster, and they don't make them anymore. Um, Why do they not make them let's anymore? shock everyone right now, but I have some Lululemons on right this you very have, second. You're wearing underwear? And yeah. are they not They're the best favorite. underwear it's, in the world? It's the only underwear that I'll wear Can't is find Lululemon. A, you can get briefs. You can get thongs. You can get... These are a brief. Um, boy oh, cut. They die. don't make Hipster anymore. Actually, actually, this the is bikini. I think this may be bikini. Boy cut is like a little short, the big, right? yes. a tiny short. I don't know. I like mine to come up a little bit more, right? Like, I don't want them to cover my belly button necessarily, but. I kind of like it to hit my belly button. <laughs> oh, my God. I used to wear underwear that was so high I couldn't wear Nike shorts because it would, my underwear would be above my Nike shorts. Why like do you inches. wear underwear with Nike shorts? It's built in. I wear underwear. I wear underwear. I oh don't not God. wear underwear. That's the only reason that the I wear The mid-rise bikini might be okay. Ooh. I feel like that would just roll right underneath the muffin top. <sighs> See? Can we go? Uh, how do we get back to underwear from this chair? Uh, how do we get back to underwear from this chair? Yeah. Please wear underwear you while read, you're sitting in the chair. You read, read the comment, comment about Hanes right. versus okay. Victoria's yes. Secret. Yes. Yes. This is your fault. So I, I have this in the back of my truck right oh. now, and I love it. So this is a truck bed car trunk organizer. I want that. This that is, is why I love nice. it. You see these little hooks right here? I you have hook two hooks them. in mine. You hook them, and the, it, the thing doesn't move. So I'm driving around the truck. The whole bed is empty, but this stays right at the front. You know what I did 20, not 20 minutes ago? You know what I did two hours ago? I flipped my truck bed down, my... What do you call it? The cover? Uh, the tailgate. Uh, I flipped my tailgate down, threw a blanket down, changed Charlie because in here in the little cubby, I had wipes, <gasps> diapers, 
little bags, everything. It was the easiest thing in the world to throw him down. Add that to the cart. Down. Add me one of those. Oh, I absolutely love this thing. You can see it's really big. It's got non-slip bottom, a lot of little storage pockets around it. Now, I have the extra large one. This one's the standard. The I extra large will the be dimensions. more expensive. But I'll, I absolutely love it. You can put so much crap in these things. So I'm a big fan. Anna, do you want me to add it to the cart? Yeah, I do. Just make sure you get the, if you want the biggest one. I'm going to go outside and measure and see which one I want. Uh, Love that, though. <laughs> uh, look how cute it is. It's Melissa and Doug. What? It's a little sandwich. They make a little sandwich. Oh, a head -to -head. my Melissa and Doug has the best kid but toys But look over here. It ever. says make a sandwich. Wait, wait, wait. Like it tells you how look, to do it? Like the recipe You cut the it? roll, the meat and cheese. How cute. I love it. So Melissa and Doug, it was really 65 bucks. It's like half off. I absolutely love that. Uh, anywho, keep keeping going. Uh, Jason bought two of these, and he's obsessed with doing block cheese now instead of bag shredded. It's and so I, good. I do have to say it makes a difference in recipes. Because it it's melts. so fresh, and it's like. It melts Because it's so not good. got wax coating on exactly. all four Well, and it has exactly. cornstarch on it. Like, the stuff that you get in the bag has, like, cornstarch on it. So we have two of these, and I actually really like them. Uh, I did add this one on here because it was a spring deal, you know, quote. But it's only like two bucks off, and you could find them even cheaper than this. Um, they got some cute colors, though. But we have two of those, and I like them. Uh, can't live without my O'Keeffe's. That is seriously on spring deal. It's actually a really good deal. It is. So two of them are 26 bucks. I usually pay $15 for one of these. Um and it's the big one. It's the value size. So this, honestly, a normal person, this both of these would last you a year. Uh, I love it. Absolutely. I have these everywhere. I can't go without them. My O'Keefe saves me. A uh, little folding wagon. I was going to put one of those. Yeah. Had a little folding wagon. Um, the capacity is insane. Yeah, throw, like your, three, yeah. throw your kids in there. We need one of those for the beach. Look how cute these colors. Now, of course, this one's cheapest. This one and this one. My only complaint with that blue. one, and it might still be fine, is that it doesn't have those, like, heavy-duty treaded wheels on it. Oh. You know what I'm talking about? I didn't think about that, Becca. But that weight capacity at that price, maybe I'll grab that one. Do they have a red one? Maybe I'll grab that they one for softball. They have a red one. Yeah, they have a red one. You know, I'm not a massive fan of red, but Fallon's I softball love colors red. are red, white, and blue. <clears throat> but I like it. Cute. I like it's it. Great. It's, a great, it's, it's more expensive, though, by a uh, little bit. Of course it is. By a little bit. Uh, okay, so if you guys did watch my uh, honeymoon vlog, you'll know that Jason bought us, like, a massive JBL speaker. But that Which I'm he called a... Boombox. Mm -hmm. I, I did explain that, too. Because he's an what? 80s child. He did. Call, he <laughs> called it a boombox. Um... I am married to a grandpa, but this is a smaller version that's more, um, like, more portable, I guess you could say. 12 hours of playtime, and it's completely waterproof, just like the one that we have. Plus, it's teal, which I think is invariable. We use, I, I have the I smaller the version ones. of the JBLs that are, like, round with the clips that are super, super loud. Mm -hmm. But I have one in my camper. I have one at home that we just use outside. Every JBL product I've used has been top-notch. I love JBL. Holds charge forever. It, now, and again, this is a really good price in my opinion. The charge for me is what, what's worth it. Yeah. Okay? The one that we have is 17 hours. You can play that thing for 17 hours and it, it should keep... Like, your phone will die three times before the, the thing That's dies. True. But, uh, yeah, this is great. Absolutely love it. Of course, everything is linked. And that's it. That's all I got. That's all you, you got. You can go back to us, Anna. Oh. I'm most excited about my granny pants. Thank you. You're very welcome. This wasn't on my list, but this is the one that I have. And as soon as it gets over there. Oh, wow. Let me go ahead now. No, well. I actually on. have that color. Everything's going <clears> to. <throat> oh, yeah. It all pops up and pops out. Give me a moment. Until... I'm going over to you, Becky. Th okay. This is um, the one that I have. This wasn't on my list. This doesn't count against me. But it's super on sale, too. 38 40 that's cute. And it's probably three to ha three and a half inches in diameter. It's like a really good, small, compact size. You can see it there on the backpack. Um, I love that one. How cute. Yep, yep, yep. I have, I think it's this one. And then I have a red one, too. Okay. Mm, Amazon. Anna, this first couple of years are yours, so. Okay. <clears throat> Guys. Now that I'm a mama, 
I have a hundred. Hold on, hold on, hold on. What? The list price is twenty two ninety nine, and the sale price is twenty two ninety eight. Well, I didn't. <laughs> I didn't look at that, but I just what wanted a it. What deal? I just wanted it. You better jump on this. I'm going to. <laughs> look how fantastic this thing is, though. I am not one that likes for my son to have screen time, but if we are going to be in the vehicle for a long time, you know, you got to pick your battles. And I can't stand for him to actually hold the thing and me have to like restart it a thousand times. So look how cute and functional this little iPad um, stand holder display thing is. And for 22 bucks, you can't beat that. So definitely going to be ordering one of those. Love it. Okay. Save my penny on that one. Then we got this one. <clears throat> okay, so mom has one of these at her house, and my mother-in-law has one as well. Ours, you can send the photos, like family can send photos to it. I don't know about this one for sure, though. But we paid like almost $300 for moms. Uh, so this is a really, really, really good deal. I Anybody that would have access to the Framio account would be able to add photos. Yes. Yeah. So um, I think it's a good way to update family photos for like grandparents and stuff like that, especially if you don't live uh, in town. But I contemplated getting one of these for my station at the salon because everyone wants to see updated pictures of the baby all the time. Um, and I think it's a good deal. I mean, 50 bucks. Baby, look at your... Yeah, look at your baby's just being good today, you. Becca. Just chilling. Um, yeah, so <laughs> what mom doesn't love tons of pictures of their kids? Or it's their a great quilts. gift for a grandparent, too. Yes. Fantastic. Hold on, I'm going back. Okay. Um, this, oh yeah, that one's yeah, yeah. I too. need this, I need this. Okay, so if you are a tech person um, and have all of the gadgets from Apple, you likely are like, how in the heck do I plug all these up on my nightstand? I've literally got my watch plugged up in my master bathroom because I don't have enough uh, plugs because our bed has to plug, plug in and, you know. Anyway, so this is a one plug, but you can charge all of it. And I like that it keeps everything nice and tidy. Um, there were some that were like super expensive that were mag safe. They're like 80 or $90, but I thought this price point was, was really good or this kind of a product. So, Jason has two and he likes his a lot. Okay. Does the phone, is it, does it connect via mag? I think it's mag. Or is it? Jason's does. His case magnetizes to it. Based off of that one that had the round magnetic looking thingy. I know, okay. I was just trying to see, cause some of them, they, they go in the bottom, which I love and I hate the mag. Right now I have a mag safe case on mine, so it would be nice, but I also love the, um, that brand of I want to say flippy it's not flippy Anna what's the brand of phone cases that we like that you put your finger in loopy loopy and you can't flippy flippy loopy yeah. you can't mag safe though so anyway yeah yep um this one is also Anna's no that, oh yeah so <clears throat> we have this on our back porch and absolutely love it. It connects to our Ring app that we have for the front door, um, but it's on our back door and it's motion activated. If you do not want the light to come on all the time, um, you can actually just turn the, the switch off from the inside of your house. Uh, but you can talk on this. The lights are super, super bright. Uh, you can set it up to give you notifications for any kind of movement. Um, and we have loved it for the back uh, because our light that was on there before, like, it was supposed to be motion activated, but it wouldn't stay on, and it basically just needed to be replaced, so we just added in the, the camera on that. $60 off is a good No, that's a phenomenal yeah. deal on that. It's well worth the 200 if you were going to pay full price for it, too. That's yours, Becca. No, it's not. I didn't do that one. That's not me. I don't even know what that is. I don't Down below, it's linked if anybody wants it. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know what that is. Okay, so <clears throat> this is my uh, ice maker <laughs> in comparison <laughs> to Rachel's. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, mine's a little more cost-effective, $15.99. Here you go, Kat. Is this yeah, more Kat, comfortable? Yeah, Kat, here you go. 
So actually, <laughs> what I was thinking was for our camper, we usually do ice uh, ice trays in there because we obviously don't have an ice maker. Uh, but this right here would give you the opportunity to make multiple things, so you're not having to wait for your <laughs> your ice. What are y'all laughing about? She's using okay. cotton panties. <laughs> <laughs> What's that? Anyway, I, um, I liked this hipster. because you could set the trays on top of it while it's freezing. It kind of still frees up space that way. And then oh, pop them in the bottom, store it, and start another set. So, loved that. Really thought, but you forgot to add granny in there. there. Next one, granny. Becca. Y'all are terrible. I'm doing my own thing. She's the you one. You forgot to add. This She's the one. You're this one's mine as well. <laughs> I have carpal tunnel, guys, from years of texting too much and doing hair and physical therapy and blah, blah, blah. And so I cannot open jars already very well, especially large ones. And I have massive hands. So this right here is a high torque, one touch electric jar opener. Um, do yourself a favor and get one of these. That way you're not having to ask your husbands to open stuff or you use a button, a, a button to open it. It's hands free. I mean, you have to use a hands free, Becca. Well, you just do like, yourself put it a favor, on the top guys. with your feet. Like <laughs> you're so stupid. <laughs> <laughs> what is happening? She's ridiculous. I think the next one is finally mine. Yeah, it's yours. But I've got more after that. Yeah, I do too. Um, electric tea kettle. Do you have an electric tea kettle? No. I love my electric tea kettle. I used to make, don't come at me, I used to make my sweet tea in the microwave and started making tea with a electric kettle because Lisa taught me the right way to you do it. You don't boil your tea in your tea bags? Yeah, I did it in the microwave. Why don't you do it on a pot on the stove? Now I do it with an electric kettle is what I'm trying to tell you. Keep going. <laughs> She's catching you. <laughs> It's amazing. You just boil the water, put the thing in there, let it set for five minutes, take it out, throw it in the water, and then it's, and did you know the proper way to make tea? You're not supposed to let it steep for longer than four to five minutes. And if you shock it with cold ice, so I put the, you know, the water in that mm -hmm. I've already, it's got the hot, and then I shock it with the cold ice, which melts it and fills it up with water, but it also makes the flavor taste better. Really? Mm -hmm. What brand of tea do you use? Louisiana. No, Lipton. What's yeah. the orange? Hold on. Fun fact about those um, electric water heater tea kettle things. I've not used one since we um, These. scraped the floor of the original studio. We had two or three of these going at once because we had so much glue on the concrete from the carpet that we had to like melt it and scrape it off. So I don't care if I ever use another one of these ever in my anyway, life. Anyway, Hamilton Bay is a solid um, company, brand. It's a good one. I also love immersion blenders. I love immersion blenders. I have two of these. I have one in the camper because I use it so much and I have one at home. And the pieces that I use the most are just the Go back, go back. This part, I can't show you because if I click the whisk part and the actual blade immersion blender part, uh, not so much the fr milk frother or the um, chopper, but uh, I mean, I, I use this all the time. It's phenomenal. And that's a really good price, $15 off. Um, next up is Anna's. That's me. Uh, I love stainless steel bowls, um, and this These are is nesting. a great price. Look at all the stuff that you get with that, uh, with the lid. I also like that for when I'm baking and you're having to, like, put dough and let it um, set and cool or whatever. Becca, click over to, I think it's the third picture. Third, not fourth. That one. So they have these attachments that go on the lid that you can grate like your vegetables and stuff down in. Um, and then you've already caught it in the bowl. I think that's really cool. And for that many pieces for what is it? I can't, $36, $37. 30, yeah. I think that's fantastic for stainless steel bowls and lids. Huh. I'm impressed. Uh, oh, we love this. That one may be mine too. It is. It's not mine. So these are the actual fondue pots we that we have. Three of these. have. Um, this may have been the one that we used on our fondue live thing with you all. 
This it just warms up good. Cuisinart is a great brand. We actually cleans paid really easily for a uh, full price for this. So we paid the eighty dollars. So this is a great deal on it. It comes with all the color coded skewers. Um, we've not had any problems out of this one. It's it's just all around a great product if you're wanting to fondue. Um, oh, this one's mine. These are amazing. I, I like I like the big chunks of like Himalayan salt, Sorry. the sea salt, and then Sorry. like the the peppercorn and all that stuff. And sometimes you know if you're if you need a lot of it because I like to season grinding that can be a pain. These yeah. right here, you literally just flip over and it's an automatic grinder. Yeah, like you don't have just, to press a button. As soon as you flip it over, it knows to grind. Two for twenty three fifty one. So great. Yeah, right? So great. I love those. And look at all the different finishes you can, you can get them in. Colors. I yeah. love those. Very cool. Love them. Um, this one's Anna's and I think it's so beautiful. So typically we just drink out of water bottles. I'll be honest. But if you are a good Southerner that likes to entertain with like sweet tea or infused waters. Make a cocktail um, of this. Look mm -hmm. how beautiful this is. You can choose different, um, qu uh, not quantities, um, sizes, sizes, but what's the word I'm looking for? Uh, anyway, you can choose different volumes? sizes. What? Volumes. Yeah, I saw that either. I'll come up with it later. But oh. I just thought that the uh, gold was really, really pretty. And yeah. now that I'm looking at it, I don't even know what the original price was. I just thought twenty bucks wasn't bad. Wow! Oh my Did God, you? Anna! I can't, it came Do off you know of the list. Oh, it's sixteen ninety nine. Oh yeah, look, yay! <laughs> look, yay! <laughs> <laughs> this one, if any of you all follow my social media, I've started doing this Tahoe Mommy Talk thing because <laughs> it's fun. Um, but the last couple ones have just been about cleaning my vehicle out because that is a constant battle as a parent. It, let me, let me hear your support if you know what I'm talking about. But this, I think, I have a dust buster, and I talked about it yesterday. I think I'm going to get this for the car. One, it's smaller, but two, it comes with all of these different attachments. It has really great reviews. It has the, the brushes and things like that you can clean with. But all of it, like the tiny little bitty pieces right here, it's going to be really awesome. You can also charge it with um, USB, which is nice, and it's on sale for $69.98, which the... Dust Buster, I can't remember if it was $30 or $40, so it's not that much more expensive. I like it. I like it at all. Uh, this is Anna's. I don't remember adding that. I, and I quote, it's a grow light because I asked you if it was a bir bird book. I know, but I didn't add it because I just wanted it. Um, if y'all want to grow plants inside, that is a good deal on one. I ferns. No, Wild is dead, guys. Did you bury her? No, I just know she's, she's not, not coming dead. back. She's not coming she back. She doesn't look good, Becca. Maybe we need to get that for Wilda. She's got natural sunlight. I don't think anything's going to be better than that. She has grubby toddler hands in her all the time. Maybe we should leave some Mozart playing today. Oh, maybe that's the problem. That is. I love this. I have never used glass cookware on top of a stove. Like, I've used casserole dishes and things like that in the oven, but I think this is so pretty. Maybe, I mean, I know it has to be a special top. It glass, has glass but. cooking pot with lid, heat resistant, I can't even pronounce that, glass cookware stovetop pot set. I think it is so beautiful. Look at that. People do TikTok simmer pots with those all the time. Oh, I love it. It's okay. I keep sliding the table. The, the little wood handle Knob. on it. It's so cute. And $24.98, actually, you know what? I didn't even look to see how big. It's 1.6 liters. So not ridiculously big. Um, but for $25, I didn't actually expect it to be huge. Cute. Uh, this one is mine. <laughs> I, I, okay, who, let me know. How do you store your plungers at your house? Mine is normally just in my garage, like on a Walmart bag. Yeah, I don't want to keep it in my... If you clog the toilet, you got to go all the way out there. What if you have a guest that's like, oh, man, I clogged your toilet. Where's the plunger? I like to have 100% access and a shame-free zone of unclogging my poos. I don't... I don't think I told Becca that have I any words. toilet. I'm pretty sure I uh, figured that out by myself. Where was it? Upstairs. When Smalls, oh, no. When we Smalls have one upstairs for me. the kids. 
know if I found it. Maybe what did it you do? Like, put your downstairs. hand in there and unclog it? it How did you unclog it? I have used a hanger before. Rachel, that's a lie. How did you unclog <laughs> it? <laughs> you put your hand in there. <laughs> and then I turn around, there's no soap! <laughs> downstairs and washed my hands so i'll I be rinsed. buying two of these one actually three one for each of my bathrooms i didn't have i don't have i think we might have one plunger for like the that whole looks house. like a good hardy plunger but i also love that it has the that's an ugly brush though becca well and i use the ones that are thrown away but in between like if you know if you just, just clean the toilet a, and you have a skid mark or something a, and you need there's to a like, streak in there yeah. Anyway, I currently I have a Walmart bag under my plunger in the garage. So I feel like this is a great solution. That was a bad rabbit trail. It's okay. Uh, I remember one time I'll never forget it. And if Tanner Bell was here, he would help me tell the story. Okay. I swear. He would always start this conversation by saying, What would you do if you were in a public? bathroom like one like one room one toilet not like there are stalls okay like you walk in lock the door behind you and then the next yeah. person comes in later. what would yeah. you do if you were in a public toilet and there was no toilet paper also no paper towels and you have you already went number two what would you do you would wipe with your underwear and throw them away that's exactly what tanner bell did <laughs> They were probably Lulu he and these took these those Lulu lemons off, <laughs> did the deed, and threw them away. What would you do? So, Walk I, around with an itchy butt? No, 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 like, no, 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 no. I would locate the trash can from the old paper towels. And use dirty paper and, towels? And sift through for some decent looking ones. Oh, my God. <laughs> you, Why have you all thought about you, this? Because Tanner Bell would ask me and the, the wheels start to Rachel, turn. that is so disgusting. What if someone w blew their nose on it and I then would, you vibed I with something? Them. I would That's inspect disgusting. them. I would inspect them. I'm very serious about wearing underwear. Well, you pooped yourself that one time and didn't wear them and you lived after that. I almost died. I could have died. I just told mom that the other day. Anywho. Here's Anna's. Okay, guys. This is my number one. Super excited about it. She may gadget. or may not have ordered one. So, <clears throat> as you all know, Mark and I are both a little older than what we actually are. And we love bird watching. We have hummingbird feeders. We have regular feeders. All the things, right? But this guy right here can capture the image of the creatures up close. So it's kind of like um, one of those, uh, you <laughs> I'm terrified, both of y'all. I'm so, so excited about this. It will send instant notifications to your phone so you can see those gorgeous cardinals up close. I'd rather unclog a toilet with my bare hands. <laughs> <laughs> Well, you go do that then. Anyway, I love this. This was a great price. Has great reviews. And um, I'm going to say that there's going to be one at the old lamb house. So everyone can be jealous when I get good pictures of my birds up close. Jessa, I always, women do. We always check for toilet paper before we sit down. I have never not done that. I check every single time. Because I'm not taking that chance. Tanner can ask me all the hypotheticals he wants, but that's just not going to happen to me. That's true. It's just not going to. But what would I do in that situation? Pilfer through the trash can. Rach, what happens if you had to go so bad that it didn't matter if there was toilet paper in Oh, oh, <laughs> see, Kat, thank you. She no. got her niece a bird feeder camera, and she loves it, and she can yell at the squirrels. Yell at the squirrels. Anna found this and added it for me. I guess it kind of counts as one of mine. Um... It's a, just a, it's like a gun and you shoot 
airplanes off of it. It's going in Becky's Easter basket. He will absolutely love this. You better get to buy this. I'm, I'm going to, Rachel. I just found it today. I get to getting it. I guarantee in less than 15 minutes, it will either be stuck in a tree or on top of our house. But you know what? That's going to be the best 15 minutes, minutes of his life. I, two. Four. Three pack. Two flight mode. Three pack. Yep. Three airplanes. Three. So. Four. Three pack foam airplane launcher. This is the four pack. Oh, the four pack comes with the red plane, which is the one he's going to want. These are baskets. He doesn't tiny. know there's a red plane. It's true. <gasps> this one's Anna's. Wait, Becca, it's junk. I bought it for the grands. No. I'm buying it anyway. <laughs> It has four and a half stars, 2,200. <laughs> like, you're going to find some people who don't like it. Look, look at all these. Kids love it. Fun. Such a fun toy. Fun. Fairly durable, but not bulletproof. Incredible gift. Did it say, but not bulletproof? Yeah. Oh, no. Oh, no. I think the next one is yours. I think it is, too. Yes. Yes. Okay, so we all know our obsession with the down power wash. The yeah. lemon is my down. favorite she meant scent. What's um, your all's favorite power wash scent? Lemon is 100% mine and Mark's. Green apple. All original. So we're all three different. But this is a great price with the refills. Um, we have stopped. I, here's the deal, guys. Mark buys most of this kind of stuff for us. So I didn't know. I was buying the one with the lid, which apparently is more expensive. I work a dog. Yeah, I know, but Mark Mark's a real stickler. But anyway, so now we want the prettier things anyway, so we just need the refills to pour them into our pretty bottles. Um, that being said that I like the green apple, I would never turn down any scent of Power Wash. If someone was like, here's a four-pack of lemon, I wouldn't be like, ooh, no. No, I would use it too. I, absolutely. Yeah. I mean, it, I love Dawn Power Wash. Um, I'm, I've had these in my cart for forever. And why does it come up at that price? That's very interesting. <sighs> It Top is, right corner says it's thirty five. Twenty nine ninety nine oh. is the deal price. They're normally forty ninety nine, and it's four picture frames. They are gold picture frames with. Um, they're sixteen by sixteen without the mat, or twelve by twelve. But that's a set of three. I'm sorry, yes, or twelve by twelve with the mat. So they're they're ten dollars a piece. That's cheap. That's a good price. And I'm gonna do a whole gallery wall when you come in my house. That is just these with fun different colored. Um, mats. So I've got, I need to buy these for sure. It's I, a great uh, deal. I, I need some more picture frames. I mean, we have so many family pictures. You do. Yeah. I need so many more frames. They also have other colors here. They have natural wood. They have black. They have silver. Um, this one, which is not actually a spring deal, but it's 10 or $11 off. And this is my favorite coffee cup. I use this all the time. It is very durable. It is 20 ounces. I love it. Wayne tries to steal it from me all the time. I gave him a crappier one that was very similar. Um, this mug is just adorable. And then this is the baby monitor that me and Rachel use. Anna, do you still have this one? Um, no. <clears throat> I have this well, I one. I the bigger version. Yeah, I keep this one in my baby bag. It's it's on sale. Huge. $45.99. And it's a smaller um, monitor. And I now, have smaller doesn't mean like, it's, it's not, not tiny. tiny. No, it's the only one I have. Honestly, I need to bring our monitor here and plug it up to one of your all's um, chargers. I think Chapman chewed on our charger and that's why it won't charge. Uh, but it could be the actual device that's not working. Yeah, you can uh, I need anyway, to look the the monitor on this is 3.2 inches and they i have one at home that's five inches too so uh, both are really great they connect very easily what i love about these monitors in general is that they do not have to be connected to wi-fi yeah so if we're camping if we're at the pool if we're here whatever it doesn't have to be on wi-fi which i absolutely love that was important to me but i have two of them i, I love them yeah i bought it i bought it again when we moved i absolutely love it the the, the one with the five inch screen, and I know you can put multiple on this one too, but the one with the five inch screen, you can put up to four cameras on. So like I have one in each of the kids' rooms, one in my rooms, cause the baby sleeps in our room. Um, I love it. Anyway, Anna, here's your <laughs> turlet Listen, seat. Guys, Again, I, was... I don't like the prices, how they're reflecting. No, but go ahead. I was so excited about this. 
<clears throat> when we go to train Chapman to use the potty, I do God not want to have to deal with dumping a child potty. You know, and so I also don't want him to have to fall through the big one. So this is a cute little alternative. I think it's super functional. Just gives a kid an area to rest their tiny bum. Look, so and you can get different wet. colors too. I think it's genius. Like absolutely genius. It's not hideous. It's not sitting in your floor. Your kids aren't pulling it around playing with it. I personally hate little potties for children. Well, here's I my other them. thing. Go ahead and get them used to sitting on the big potty because then you're not having to, hey, we're training you on this potty, but then now we have to train you to transition to the big yeah. potty. So just I get it over with. I think the only non-toilet potty I'll have is like an emergency potty that collapses in the car. Here's you know, the, the thing, though, Rach. You pop out like side of the road. But he's poop. a boy. Well, that's very rare that they have to poop on the side of the road. Rare does not mean it never happens. That's true. But yeah, since he's a boy, I'll be like, yeah. Go pee in the bush, son. I uh, I had a little potty for Beckett. Very quickly got rid of it and ended up just using, uh, honestly, not even a, a small toilet seat for he and Fallon. But this, I think Pearson will get a little toilet seat for his little booty. Um, this I think is really neat. And this is a really inexpensive price. And the ones, the other ones that I've seen were like 150, 130 ish dollars. This doesn't come with the balls. It's just the playpen and it's like this foam playpen. You can get the balls uber cheap yeah. though. Yeah. And, um, it folds up really small because it is foam. We need to get this for here. I, yeah, that would be fun. Oh yeah. And would we have to rock, paper, scissors for who's going to pick up all the balls? Oh, oh no, God. the kids can do that. You know, Fallon's really good at cleaning. Anyway. Big spring deal. It's a great price. Um, and then this I thought was really, really cute. They're 40% off. $17.99 for all of these teething toys. Stacy, I know your grandkids need these. Look how cute the colors really are. Cute. Rachel, look at that bee right there. Isn't it adorable? Does it make you want to have another kid? No. Um, but yeah, $17.99 for all of these. And normally if you're going to buy these at Walmart, they're like three to four or three to five dollars a piece. So I feel like that's a really good deal. Um, that's all I have. So you can go, you can go back to us. Let My us know. My laptop has got twelve percent battery. I'll pull it up over here. It's okay. Um, any, any questions? If I keep pushing it. No, it's me. It's hundred percent me. Any questions? Concerns? Song requests? Anything? Song re Oh, song requests. Okay. Um, <coughs> let me. <coughs> Um, Maybe I didn't have another burp to give you guys. I, it's You know why I'm burping is because of all the cucumbers. I, cucumbers give me the burps and the heartburn. Oh, me too, but I eat them anyway. Avril Lavigne. Complicated. I don't even know how that song starts. Well, I, it doesn't matter. Just hit the verse or the chorus. You, you do it. Oh, why you got it? Everything's so complicated. Uh, you're not singing loud enough. I see the way you're acting oh like you're somebody be. else. Gets, gets me, me frustrated. frustrated. Life's like that. Yeah. You fall. Something. Wow. Back at the baby monitor, how mm -hmm. does it connect? Do you mean? It's Bluetooth. Yeah. It's, it Bluetooths to the monitor. Um, the, the camera actually plugs into the wall. And then it Bluetooths to the baby monitor. And the baby monitor, you, you it's rechargeable. So you can keep it plugged in if you want. Or you can unplug it and yeah. walk around with it. Like we have Battery life, so I'm going to say eight hours. It's amazing. Yeah, it's it won't last long, all night. It's got a so you need battery. to plug it in if it's going to be all night. Like we'll put yeah. Chapman in the bed and then go out on the back porch with his monitor yeah. or something. Yeah, but and like The range naps. is great too. Yeah, range is great. It, Charlie's right above us right now. And we can still be like in the pool. And it reaches. Yes. Like yeah. it's it's got a really good Well and even like when we're camping, if we have like three or four campers, for instance, if I put my kid down and then I put the baby monitor in the camper and go over four campers to play games while he's asleep, um, it, it still connects. It's really nice. Um any craft supplies on your list. Lorraine, I actually looked up craft supplies and they were not a lot. Excuse me, any good or um there were some craft supplies, but nothing that I would promote. Mind yeah, you. like this is like what you have to buy, and it just ended up that we didn't have the least amount. Yeah. Kat said, on future vlogs, Jason needs to talk less. It was very distracting. Kat, I know. Like, I don't know how many times, Becca, in the vlog, I was like, say something. And he was like, 
<laughs> and I'm like, I just wish that you guys knew Jason because especially if you get a couple drinks in him, <laughs> the man will not. He will him. not shut up. He will not shut up. and he Which listens. is when I get all the good information he's out of him. He's got a lot to say about a lot of different subjects. He's a very smart man. Uh, he thinks that he's the funniest thing on two <laughs> feet, that just God poured all of the humor into him. He laughs at himself the majority of the day and likes to think of ways to torture me. So, and the man w would not speak on that blog, and I promise you, he talks so much. We're always, I always joke that I'm his best friend, that we're best friends. Yes. And um, he has this Stanley cup. It's like a Bill Pils or a beer Pilsner type cup here, and I don't have one. And so I use his when he's not here. And so I mentioned that it was our shared cup. And then I cut out a, a sticker of me and put it on there. And yes. And so the next time I came, he's sitting over in his chair just laughing. Just laughing. I didn't, I mean, it took me a while to even look for the cup. And he had drawn like horns and a mustache on my picture. But you know what he didn't do? Take the picture off. No. And he wouldn't. No, he would never. Would never. But um, he is a man of few words until you get, so you get his guard down, or you get a couple drinks in him. I have a new granddaughter, and my son doesn't want one with Wi-Fi. Yes, it's. Uh, Tammy, hold on just a second. Let me show you the one that I have. Hello, baby. Five inch monitor. I got the one with the two cameras. And if you want to go back over. This is the one that I have at home because the screen is bigger. It's just a preference. It's on sale too for 137 and that's with two cameras, like I said. But you can get it with just one too. Um, and it is the same. It's the same brand and it is not Wi-Fi either. So I love check that those out. baby monitor. Yeah. I do too. I mean, people, I never wanted one that was on my phone either. That was one thing. I had one that was on my phone for a while, but the problem is if you have a babysitter, like yeah, the baby. Yeah. Or if you're wanting to, if you're like on your phone, but you hear the baby and you just want to quick look at the monitor. Yeah. Mine will do both. Really? Some of them will. I found one that was actually on a spring deal today that would do both. And it actually came with a camera, which was pretty neat. It had a clip that would go on the side of the bed and would go over the bed. And then it had a 360 camera as well. Oh. Um, but it was not cheap. Which, anyway. But let's talk about this. You're probably going to use it for like five years. Yeah, you're probably going to yeah. use the baby monitor because when they start getting into their toddler bed, you're going to want to put it in the corner of the room to continue to look at them. I have like, to be you're honest. You're going to use them forever. It's up in, Mark, uh, in uh, Chapman's corner already. When we moved to our new house, which was five years ago, Beckett was six, and so I didn't put a baby monitor in his room. Very quickly ended up putting a baby monitor in his you room. You just want to look at them sometimes because... Maybe they're being too quiet or too loud. Both of those are, are, are bad. So there's still a monitor in his room. Listen. Listen. I was trying to find that baby monitor. The other one. But I think it was Wi-Fi. Spring. Sale. And guys, everything is linked down below. Literally like 50 links are linked down below. So grab. If one person does not buy that bird feeder, I'm going to be super upset. Oh, here's the baby monitor. Go back to my computer. This is a spring deal. It's on sale for $100. And it has the five inch display. And it has the two way talk free or two way talk. It is Wi Fi, but it does have um, the monitor capability or the app capability. And like I said, a camera that will clip to the edge of the bed like that. Or you can put it other places. Pretty cool. 100 bucks. Not bad at all. Anywho, thanks for being here with us. This is a fun life. Yeah. And is my baby still asleep? He is. Yay. All the babies are asleep. Listen, Chapman and Charlie have eaten us out of house and home today. They never and neither eat. Neither one are big eaters. I'm pumped about it, though. He <laughs> ate, Charlie ate like four chocolate chip cookies, and Becca was like, is he going to throw up? And like that was after he ate over biscuits, half a biscuit and. Strawberries, oranges, yeah. pickles. I'm happy about it. If the kid 
First, I have to be honest, we thought maybe he was putting the cookies somewhere or crumbling oh, them up oh, all over the no, that floor. No, that was like, I was 90% certain there was going to be cookies all over Jason's leather recliner. No. He's eating them. I don't know where they're going in that little belly of his, but he's eating them. That's probably why he's sleeping so good. Good. Mm -hmm. Sleep, buddy. Yeah. Sleep. Well, we've been snacking. We made a little charcuterie board. Um, yeah. We were super excited to do this live for y'all. Um, let us know if you like this kind of stuff. Uh, I'm sure Becca would love to start vlogging in her Tahoe. Maybe we could compile a week's worth of Tahoe talks into a little vlog for who knows if you guys like stuff like that let us know if you like little glimpses into our lives that aren't craft related to be supplemental content for you guys uh join the membership if you haven't already if you're looking for a great community not just for cricketing but any type of crafting that you would like to become a little more well-rounded or confident in doing that's what oak and lamb is for so join if you haven't already use code crafty but we'll see you guys later. We're super excited that you were with us today. Uh, buy everything you want. Everything is linked down below. Click and buy. And then let us know what we talked you into buying. Oh, please. Please I mean, comment I, down I below. I know that there's probably going to be like 900 sets of granny panties bought. I hope. I now, bet there's already my, been some. My one thing to remind you guys is how high they come up. Because it can be jarring. To people who aren't used to, I'm telling you. Okay, let me just my show leggings you. come up to here. Let me here. just show you right now. I wear leggings that come up. Same. This is how high Same. my leggings are. Okay, my underwear are like down here. Okay, but if you're used to wearing high leggings, these are not gonna be scary. But if you're used to wearing, there's you know, nothing worse than having a pair of underwear that hits you right here and like cut you. You don't and want then, that. Like, but now my leggings, they're, they're darn near touching my bra. And I'm fine with that. And these aren't pregnancy leggings. They're the our favorite kind from um, Old Navy. I'm just saying, if you're, it, they come up high. But I do love them. I will be buying more today. <laughs> but at that price, how can you not? Becca, maybe you should buy some. I if they weren't, like, uh, there's just not the material I love. Nothing is wrong with cotton. I don't, I'm, I'm not saying there's anything wrong with them. I just like that, like, super stretchy, like. Like nylon spandex. Kind of. I don't like any seams at all. Or rayon. All. Am I thinking rayon? I don't, I don't know. know. What's, what are these made out of? Ray, no rayon. Idea. These are, these are. Are those the Lulus? These are the Lulus. They are nylon lycra. The nylon. gusset's 100% cotton. The gusset. A cotton gusset. <laughs> Oh, my God. We'll see y'all later. <laughs> we love you all. Bye. <laughs> Laka.